we doing, everyone? My name is Michael Warden, and if you're new here, well, I gotta say, it's a pleasure to meet you. And this right here, I'm gonna talk about you picking a character in this lovely fighting game called Tekken 8. Now, before I continue on talking about all these neat characters, I gotta shrink myself here. I know I'm kind of covering the, the, you know, the main uh, character picking screen here. So let me just uh, shrink myself down here for you guys. Here, I'm going to put myself in what they call P2 part of the game. That's, you know, this is P1 over here, and then this is P2. So I'm going to put myself in P2 because obviously I'm controlling the person to pick a character on P1. You know, player one, player two. That's that's what that's what the acronym's for. But anyways, so you're interested in playing Tekken. I... You know, I already covered the notations and stuff, and you should be able to put together what one and two and all that means, and then based on what you see with the character you pick and the move list and stuff. But now you're like, hmm, who do I want to play? And respectfully, you have 32 characters, and then and then ne and then there will be 33 given in the next couple of weeks or so, and. You know, you're like, oh, I don't know who to play. I don't know what I like. Well, I got. I like to think this is just my personal opinion. Every, 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 every person's opinion is very valuable to very uh, valuable to listen to, and you know, it never hurts to hear a different side of things. To me, I feel like this game does it all. I feel like Tekken's always done a good job of giving you something that we all may want. You know, we got animals. We got Characters with wings that also shoot lasers like Superman. We have cyborgs. We got, uh, you know, cool uh, Chinese and some kind of uh, Asian style fighting. Uh, I don't know if she does. Yeah, Chinese martial arts. You know, uh, Tachi Kwan or uh, where's the other one? Uh, martial arts. I thought he did something that Bruce Lee did. But we have it all. And if you're wondering, Mike, you know, is there a difficulty learning some of these characters? Well, I'm going to say that there, in Tekken standards, there is easy and, and difficult characters to learn. But the, the characters that you that you may want to start are that you think are easy. In all reality, they're they're still difficult. Like it's still difficult to play correctly because of how this game is built. So in Tekken standards, yes, these, some of these characters you know can be easy. Some that come to my mind are like Jack. Um, let's see who else. Uh, where is he? Uh, Lars. <laughs> um. Uh, what else? Uh, Victor. Victor's pretty easy. Um, who else? Uh, Paul. He's fun to play. So, as I said, you, you have different characters. You know, easy, medium to expert level. It, you know, at the end of the day, if if you're new to fighting games and you're new and or you're new and or you're new to Tekken. Listen, don't care about how difficult, how easy, hard, or medium a character is to learn and play. Just, just play them. It, is it, is it take you a bit of a grind to maybe get good and, and to get where you want to? Yeah, but just, just play whoever you want to. Just play whoever your heart wants to. I mean, you know, at the end of the day, when you play this game, you want to have fun. Regardless, you want to have fun no matter what. Because when you have fun and you're not stressed about anything, then you learn, and that's what's more important. Uh, a Tekken streamer on Twitch and on here, obviously, he um he, he made a good point. His name is uh, Fidiax. I, I like to I like to make the joke that he has got a PhD in Tekken because his name is P H I, and then and then it's the uppercase D and a lowercase X, and it's you know Fidiax, and. I remember he was helping out a guy by the name of uh, Disgusting Toast. Is it, is, it, is, it, is it Disgusting or Disguising Toast? Something, something Toast. I don't know. Something with bread that gets burnt somewhat. And um, 
and that's what FDX told this guy. He said, he goes, look, he goes, if you play this character, you want to have fun when you're losing. So, yeah, that that's my assessment. I'm picking a character. Just pick a character you like based on look, style, attitude, demeanor, whatever, and just have fun. And that's all that's important. And that's all I really got to say about that. So, uh, we'll see ya. Yeah.